Hello and welcome to another video. This is Yaga Station. It's one stop from Hiroshima on the Gabi Line. As you can see, the station is a fairly small one and to be honest, there's not that much special about it. Apart from one thing, that is. It's right next to the Hiroshima Shinkansen Depot. As you can see, above the station is a section of elevated railway. This is the spur from the main Shinkansen line all the way to the depot. Shinkansen services which terminate at or start from Hiroshima station all use this spur to move between the depot and the station, or vice versa. From the overbridge at Yaga station, there's a good view of Shinkansen trains entering and leaving the depot using the spur. With the current timetable, as of November 2023, for most of the day there's about one train an hour from Tokyo that terminates at Hiroshima, and one train an hour to Tokyo that starts from Hiroshima. As I say, there's a fairly good view of the spur from the overbridge at Yaga Station. But if you want to go further than this, it's pretty easy to get to the depot itself. From Yaga Station, take the road immediately to the right of the station building, and if you walk for about five minutes from there, you'll get to a level crossing. Cross the crossing, and you'll see another overbridge in front of you. This overbridge goes all the way across the depot, giving you a very good view. There are several exits from the overbridge, but if you take the one that's very clearly at the far end of the depot, you can walk around to the back of the depot, from which you can normally see quite a few stabled trains. From this point, there's not really a great deal more to see, and the easiest way back to Yaga Station is basically the way you came. It doesn't really take that long to see most of what there is to see at the Shinkansen Depot. But if you're in Hiroshima, if you're interested in trains, railways, Shinkansen in particular, and you have an hour or two free, it's worth a visit, I suppose. Anyway, that's about it for this video, I'd say. As ever, thanks for watching. Please do leave a comment and a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you again in another video very soon. Thanks again, and bye for now.